Hello, my friends. So it is Thursday, the second week of Advent, and the title for today's devotion is Make It Visible. Deuteronomy 6 verse 9 says this, You shall write them on your doorposts of your house and on your gates. God gave instructions to the Israelites on what to do with the commandments he had given them. Impress them on your children. Talk about them. Learn from them. Tie them as symbols on your hands and foreheads and put them on the doorposts of your homes. It would be hard to forget God's commandments if we had them written in all those places as reminders of how we should live. Do you use these techniques when it comes to committing things to memory? Like maybe the verses that you needed to learn or, or the, the specific lines that you have for your Christmas programs? Hmm, I wonder if you've done that. It's not a bad idea when you are learning something to have it in front of you in several places so that you are constantly thinking about what you need to memorize. How important is it to have a constant reminder of how God loves us? Not too many people include God's commandments or promises in their interior decorating schemes, but there are many who do put up reminders of God's love for them around their homes. These could be in the form of pictures, crosses, and other pieces of art that remind you of who God is throughout your day. Let's pray. Dear creative Lord, Thanks for commanding your first covenant people with the task of putting your commandments all around them. Help us to be reminded throughout every day of your commandments, love, and grace by the physical things with which we are surrounded. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. And now it's time for our Get the Word Out Challenge. It says, try and find a reminder of God in each room of your house. If you can't find something, Think about what you could add to remind you of God's love and faithfulness. That is awesome. I'm definitely going to be doing that. Hmm. I got to get busy. I love you, friends. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.